In this tutorial, we are going to see how to install IAB version 10 in Windows machine. So the agenda of this tutorial is to the installation of IAB in Windows environment. We will also see what are the supported hardware and software and at last we will also verify whether IAB is successfully installed or not. Okay. So IAB can be installed in all the major operating system like I say AIX, ZOS, from HP, HPUX, Linux, Solaris and Windows. The software requirement for IAB is minimum 3, 2.3 GB disk space means hard disk drive we need minimum 2.3 GB and the minimum RAM which is needed for IAB installation is 4 GB and uh, 2 GB is needed for if we want to have integration toolkit. So now uh, let's see how to install IAB. Uh, if you see over here I have kept the IAB version 10 installable. You just need to go inside and there is a file called as IAB setup 10.0. Just right click and run as administrator. It's a very straightforward of installation process. Just uh, agree the license terms and condition and click on the install button. It will take around 4 to 5 minutes for the installation and once the installation is completed you will see the IAB toolkit installed over here. So hence Installation is completed. Now we will verify the whether the installation is done successfully or not. So these are the commands which we can use to check whether the installation is completed success successfully or not. Like I say IAB build. This command will tell us the installation build number. IAB level. This will display the installation build level. IAB verify to check whether the IB is installed or not, IB version will give the latest uh, the version of the IB which is installed in the system. Okay, so we will just uh, see few of these commands. So we can go over here, and you can see IB integration toolkit is also installed. You can just go over here in IBM. Okay, I. Uh, IBM integration bus, IB integration toolkit and IBM integration console. So here we can write, write the, the commands like as IAB version and you can see the this is the installation directory you can see C program files IBM IAB 10.0.0.7 and this is the product I, IBM integration bus bill number is 220 we can also see IAB toolkit which after the installation in IAB 10 MQ is not included in the installation package so if we want to in use MQ related flows so we need to install MQ separately till, till 9.0 MQ is mandatory for running any sort of a message flow but in 10.0 MQ is not included with IAB so once when you install IAB it will only install IAB okay no MQ so here you can see after the installation it will automatically create a test node integration node and uh, this is the my user ID from which I have logged into this system administrator and uh, if you right click over here and see the change here you can give the queue manager name if you are associating this integration node with MQ queue manager okay so thank you we learned about